Hi, I'm Chelsea from Heartfelt Happenings. Go ahead and check out the blog. And today I'm actually giving you a video and this is a review of the Jujube Pack B diaper bag. So it's kind of a what's up diaper bag and a review of the product as well. This is a great diaper bag. I love it. I actually bought it used, so it does have some staining and some wear, but it is still great. All the zippers are intact, it's strong. When I got it, I washed it through and through. All the Jujube backpacks are machine washable and it came out um, came out great. I mean, every zipper was intact, there was no fraying, so that was already steps up above the bag I had before. This one, the Packaby, has a couple features. Um, has memory foam on the messenger strap, messenger strap here. Um, can be held messenger style. You can also do it backpack style, which is how I like to wear it. Um, preferred method there. So you can do backpack. We have a back pocket here and it has a changing pad. There's two side pockets on the side. Um, these are insulated. So Jujubee has a couple of different features. I'm sure if you've seen some other Jujubee videos you might know, but it's Teflon treated so it repels any stains, water. Inside it has Agion, so you know any um, you leave in there, bacteria is not going to grow. And then the insulated pockets, they are um, insulated with insulate, which means they keep your drinks cold or hot. And this is up to three hours, so I usually drink my drink before that three hour mark, so I've never tested it out. But we'll go ahead and start on this side. And um, here on this one, they have a little elastic, so they really come out really well. But I just put my cell phone on this side. On the other side, I keep a large water bottle, and you can see that this bottle goes all the way down. So it's really great. If you had a smaller bottle, it would fit, and the large ones fit really well as well. In the back pocket, I have the memory foam changing pad, and this came with the bag. And I also put back here um, my Erin Condren Life Planner. So I always have it on me. It's easy to grab back here. And then in here I have some pens and I keep a checkbook in the little zipper pocket inside that. So, and that is all I have back there. Okay. On the sides here you have these two hooks. These can be stroller hooks. You just get the stroller straps for them. On this one, I just have a Bath & Body Works antibacterial hand gel. This is in fresh picked apples. It smells great. The Packaby has two front pockets. It has a lower pocket and it has a top pocket. And this is your GGB mommy pocket. These have magnets. You can hear that. So that's great. I mean, you can just let it open and it'll totally find where it's supposed to go. This bottom one actually flips right up to the top. That's been really handy because when I am wearing it backpack style, I'm able to keep it on my back, flip this up, and then my wallet, I keep my wallet in here, and I can get my wallet out without even having to take the backpack off or anything else like that, and I can slip it back in too. If it's a rather large wallet, um, it is kind of a tight fit, but it fits. So I just have here, it's a coach checkbook wallet, but I don't keep my checkbook in here. Like I said, I actually keep it in here. I also just have some Cottonelle wipes, so they're easy to get to. And then this has the beautiful kind of champagne lining, and then it also has the two mesh pockets. These are really elastic. They can fit a lot in them, but the great thing is about it that I like is that they're tight. It really restricts back, so nothing's going to fall out. So on one side, I just keep a bunch of cards, so I always have them on me. They're club cards, punch cards, etc. On the other side, I have coupons um, to the Irvine Railroad, which I've talked about. We go to a lot, I've written a different blog post on it. Love that place. They have trains, ponies, lake, fishing, everything. Great. All right, the top, my pocket, up here. I have this pretty well stuffed, so it's awesome fit a lot in here. Um, has the elastic key fob. I do actually put my keys on here. I'm home, so I don't have them on here right now. I like to keep it out. Sometimes I'll drop them in, but out is great too. Go like that. 
has a spot for two pictures. I actually haven't put a picture of my son or my daughter in here yet. I'm gonna get on that though. All right, so you can see in here, I have a few different things. I have this, it's just a, I use it as a hand cream. It's Burt's Bees, Milk and Honey. I have Clinique Dramatizing Lotion, and I use that for my face. And then I also have a Clinique small pouch, and inside the small pouch is just various little things. So Clinique pressed powder, some eyeshadow, Clinique eye concealer, Clinique foundation, eyeliner, and Pore Professional from Benefit. I absolutely love this stuff. It's like airbrush on your face. It's amazing. So all those little, little travel things just fit right in this. Really nice. Handy that way. I also have a little pen. Always need a pen. Tied to go pen. I have a safety first nail clippers with a flashlight. I really prefer the ones with a flashlight, make it easy to find the little nails. I have some nail files, so if you know my little baby girl's ever asleep or anything like that, or we have a chance to clip her nails, I will. If I notice they've gotten long, she's a scratcher. So in here you can see it has this pocket and then it also has like a mesh pocket. I have some tissues in here. In the mesh pocket I have Burt's Bees Grapefruit. I have Burt's Bees hand saw, but I just use this on my cuticles. So if I'm, you know, in the car waiting for something or anything else, rub it in. Let's see. Oh, I have cold sore treatment. And hairbrush. And then there's a zipper pocket back here as well. And let's see. I have just a cliff bar, crunchy peanut butter, extra energy if I ever eat. And there's some C's candies, you know, emergency candy. Doctor's office or some other boring office. And my son, who's a toddler, needs that. Probably should mention I have a toddler and a newborn. My daughter is eight weeks and my son is almost three years old. So this backpack that bag is mainly for her. My son actually does a Pottery Barn Kids backpack that he tows around himself. So everything in here is just for the baby. All right, let's pull these down. The very top of, I'm gonna go ahead and just pull this down so you can really see what's in here. And I love this, it's really beautiful color. It's light, I like it. All right, so the very top, I actually have a Jujube Be Quick and it's in the Tiki Toffee also. Pull it out, I keep it right on top. It has a little wristlet strap, so it's easy to grab. Everything, most likely what I'm going in the backpack for is diapers. In the Be Quick, I can actually keep quite a bit. So I have Pampers Be Sensitive Wipes. I have a Cottonelle Changing Pad. Oh no, no, that's not Cottonelle, that's Munchkin, yeah. The Munchkin to Hillsville changing pad. <laughs> I have a few diapers. These are actually size newborn. So one, two, three, four, five, six Pampers Swaddlers, size newborn. Um, Purell hand sanitizer, Dustin diaper cream. And then the Be Quicks have a zipper pocket. And in my zipper pocket, I just keep Ziplocs. These are great to dispose of anything that you need to dispose of. And I'm not sure if you can see this, but just all the little details of Jujube. The zipper has three little stars on it. And the bigger zippers all have little rhinestones. So really love little details. Okay. In the Packaby, you have two mesh pockets back here that allow for a lot of room. There is a zipper pocket up top right here that kind of goes deep down and it's on the back of the diaper bag, so it's gonna be with a changing pad and my life planner. And then there's another mesh pocket on this side. So zipper pocket, mesh pocket, and then two mesh pockets. I'm gonna pull out the middle first and then we'll go to the pockets. So in the middle, I have a Clinique large pouch 
And inside this is just some toys. Like I said, I don't have any toys for my son because he does his in his backpack. These are just for my daughter. And I just clip this right onto her car seat on wrap. And then there's just some rattles here. There's a newbie teething ring, sassy rattle, Fisher Price, little fish, and then just a bright baby, baby book about animals. So that all fits in there. Her big brother likes to read to her, so he'll read, you know, he knows all the animals, he can read that book. She doesn't have any teeth, but she's starting to grab things, so if she ever just went out and about and she wants to grab something, we're good to go. Okay, and then I have the Clinique small pouch, and this one has all of my nursing essentials in it. So in here I have a, this is just a thin Carter's nursing cover. And then I have two Medela disposable individually wrapped um, nursing pads. I actually wear reusable ones, but if I ever forget one or lose it, which I have done, or something else, or it just gets soaked, I have some disposable ones. I also keep um, Mother Love Nipple Cream. I have the big jar, but when I'm out and about, I just get these at my local breastfeeding boutique. These is actually great if you've never heard of Mother Love. It's um, like lanolin. It keeps everything, um, it has the same properties as lanolin, but it also has um, healing properties, which is really nice. Um, and then just some um, prolactin supplements there. Okay. So all of this fits quite nicely in this really small pouch. And then I also keep in a spare bottle of water. And I told you I keep one on the outside as well, but this is just if I ever forget that one or it runs out. If I'm nursing, I have it. I know I have this one in here and this is just 12 flowing ounces and the bottle is from Brighton. It has little roses on it, which I thought was cute. Got picked it up when I was shopping there one day. Um, this is a large blanket. This is a Swaddle Me and it's in pink dot. So kind of really big. I just roll it up and it fits right in there and this blanket's great because it's flannel and it's really soft and can be really warm but also can be applied lightly. And then the very bottom of the bag I just have a Arm & Hammer air freshener from Munchkin to throw in the bottom there. Alright, so let's do the back mesh pocket over here. Um, if I have a flannel blanket, but if that's too big, if I want something smaller, lightweight, I have this blanket right here, and this is by Little Me, and it has little roses on it, so I just thought it was cute for my little girl. Also in the back mesh pocket, I have a burp cloth, and this is also by Swaddle Me, and this is just one of their regular designs. The back zipper pocket, I actually keep an extra shirt. For myself. You never know when you might need an extra shirt with the baby around. And again, the GW little zipper in here has three little stars, it's all the little details. Alright, in this mesh pocket right here, let's see, kind of get that, okay. That mesh pocket, I have a Jujube Be Mine in Tiki Toffee. And I like to have it pulled like this so I can just kind of give it a yank and it'll come out. This is um, Jujube Mine, is like a wristlet wallet. I actually use it as a first aid kit and I got the idea from a lot of other Jujube videos. And I thought it was a great way to keep a few different, you know, um, band aids or whatever else you might need. And again, it has the Jujube. Zipper with a little rhinestone there, and the little back one has like a little star. So, in the back, I keep in the back pocket here. I just keep some alcohol swabs. So there's four alcohol swabs in the back. I had a lot more, but I figured I'm only gonna need one, and I can always restock. And the be mine, I have. Just right here, popped in the middle, is um, hydrocortisone cream. And 
you know, never know. We kind of go, we take walks. So if we ever encounter some poison ivy or if I get a little bit of a rash from something else, really great to have that. Um, this is, like I said, a wallet. So it has these little elastics here. I think it's for your like lipstick and your pen. I don't have, I don't keep the pen in here. I bought this used as well, so it didn't come with a pen. But I have baby aura gel. My daughter hasn't started teething yet, but I did have it on hand, so I just put that in there. Um, down at the bottom, I don't know why, I thought I might need this as my first aid kit, but you never know. It's actually just a pink buck pocket knife, and I got it for Christmas, so it has my name engraved on it. So it's one of my favorites. So I just keep that there as well. Um, in here, this um, little like ID pocket, I keep a little fact card with names. Um, my children don't have any allergies, but just names and then our, our insurance information. I don't have it in there for the video though. And these are just stickers. My son loves Disneyland, Mickey Mouse, and Minnie, and Daisy, so these stickers are there. Um, in this zipper pocket, so you have this little pocket right here, and then it goes to a zipper pocket. In the zipper pocket, I just keep some eye drops, some Neosporin to go, and tweezers, which are great for a first aid kit. All right, on this side, there is an elastic pocket, and here I keep a few things, actually. I keep some tape for gauze, Johnson & Johnson, allergy relief, that's just from Target, and then I keep a couple gauze pads from Johnson & Johnson, and different um, variety of band-aids. So I have some Mickey Mouse band-aids, and Some other character cute little band-aids but this one's a really small one this is your regular typical size band-aid and then if it's a bigger and for any reason might need a bigger cover a bigger area then I have the gauze pads so one two three four regular size two small band-aids four gauze pads in there and then some tape. You can also use the pocket knife to just cut the tape if I need to. And algae relief. So that's what I have in the Jujube Be Mine in my little first aid kit there. All right. And this other lap, the last mesh pocket right over here. I just keep a Ziploc. This is a quart size Ziploc and it has an extra outfit in it for my eight week old. So I like keeping it a Ziploc because if I need to change her outfit then this where the dirty clothes could go back in. There's a headband, pair of pants, onesie, and a matching pair of socks. This is all size newborn. But I've seen people fit a lot more in it as well. So I think you could fit as much in it as you need it to. All right, that's it. The Juju B, B, Pack of B, that bag, I love it. There's only, I, was, I mean, one of my first day using it, I did hear complaints about there's no grab handle at the top. But like I said, these zippers are incredibly sturdy. So I will leave it unzipped a little bit at the top and I just grab it like that and you can totally grab it when it's completely full and it works great. So thank you, I hope you enjoyed the video and go ahead and subscribe to my channel or check out my blog, Heartfelt Afternoons.